Hey superstars, it's your girl Malika, AKA Ms. Magic, back with another video. So today I am going to be doing a silk press, a six month limb check silk press on my hair. And I'm going to share with you some of my favorite silk press products that gets the job done absolutely beautiful. So first, if you are interested in that, go ahead and hit that subscribe button for me. If you like this video, give me a big thumbs up and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you can be alerted when I do post another video. All right guys, so we are gonna get started. I am on like a six day wash and go, so we're gonna wash our hair. Um, my shampoos don't really matter as much. I usually kind of use any shampoo that's in my um, shower. I like Aussie Moist, I like I mean, I got some expensive, I got the highs to the lows. I have the high-end Olaplex and Briagio, or am I pronouncing that right, Briage, whatever. And then I got your lows, I got your Cantus, I got your uh, Suave. It really doesn't matter when I shampoo, but I just need my hair to be clean, and I also need it to be free of product, and it doesn't have to be super moisturized because my, I want my um, silk, press, silk press to flow. So I notice when you use a more drying shampoo, I get more flow with my silk press. But well, I'm gonna be back, I'm gonna wash my hair, and we'll come back with the rest. All right, so I am fresh out the shower. I have shampooed my hair. Like I said, for the shampoo, I do kind of like a any mini mining mo as long as my hair is a, a, a deep cleanse. So today I went with the main choice hydration therapy shampoo. Like I said, it really doesn't matter too much to me, but that's what I went with. And when I am still pressing my hair, I do not deep condition. I just use a, 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 a conditioner that I know is going to have great slip. And I went with the Suave Wild Blossom um, Essentials. You can use any kind of cheap old shampoo because it gives your hair amazing slip. So what I'm going to do now, you see it is detangled all the way through. I don't have to worry about it. I don't have no knots, none of that. So I'm going to part my hair into four and then we're gonna get started on the blow dry. All right, so I am sectioned into fours. Before I blow dry, I twist my hair up into four sections, tie them up so it can stretch a little bit before I blow dry. Then now I just drew on some eyebrows and moisturize my face. So we are just gonna take down the first section that I'm gonna blow dry. See how it's twisted so that kind of stretches out a little bit before we get into blow drying. I'm gonna take it down and then I'm gonna take this section and split it into two and then just clip up this part. Now one of my first favorite products is this heat protectant because it acts as a heat protectant spray and it acts as a, um, a 360 so that your hair stays silk pressed for more than two, three days. And what it is is the L'Oreal Sleek It Iron, Iron Straight Heat Spray. And this is what it looks like. They sell it at Walmart, they sell it online, on, on Amazon, pretty much anywhere. So you just go ahead and spray. Wait a minute. Spray a little bit on your hair. And then I'll just comb that through with the regular comb so I can make sure that it's thoroughly detangled. And I just use a basic blow dryer, nothing fancy. I don't have the fancy blow dryer, so it's a red blow dryer from Walmart. And I'm gonna go ahead and blow dry this first section. So just like that, I'm not going to bo uh, bore you guys. Uh, that's my hair, how it's blow dried. I, I use a medium warm, so I'm not on super hot. And I'm gonna go ahead, spray each section with the heat protectant, and I'm gonna finish blow drying. I'll be back when I'm through blow drying my full head. All right guys, I am all blow dried. Um, yeah, that was a lot. So I'm gonna take you through this quick Beyonce moment. enough of the shenanigans. I only did that because I was hot as hell and I needed to cool off. So I did that on a cool blow dry. Um, that's a tip. If you get really hot, just put your blow dry on cool and blow it in your face. So it feels so good. All right, we're gonna get right into this, uh, excuse me. We're gonna get right into this silk press. All right guys, so there are three main essentials, no, four main essentials I need when I am flat ironing my hair. 
and the first is a silk press uh, oil. So usually I use Chi oil, but if your coins ain't right, you can just go to this Cantu Shea Border Shea Butter Super Shine Hair Silk. And they sell this at most beauty supply houses or you can buy it on Walmart at Walmart. And basically you just take a little dime size for each section, not more than that. Rub it in your hands and then just go ahead and rub it all throughout. And this gives your hair that silky shiny look that you want with your silk press. Second thing you're going to need is a nice tail comb. This is a tail comb, uh, yeah, a tail comb with small uh, teeth so that you can comb easily through your hair when you are parting. And then the third thing you're going to need is, the, um, I love this, this is a glosser, is the pink uh, oil glosser. I use this for extra shine. Um, and I usually just spray it on my hair through the sections. And the fourth thing you're gonna need is a thermal hairspray. And this also aids in um, keeping your hair from, uh, straight through the humidity. Okay, so first thing I'm going to do is just part off a section of my hair. And then we just clip it up. And of course, the number one star, I said four things, but it's really five. The number one star is your flat iron. You can use any flat iron you want. This is just my trusty Dusty. This is a Remington anti-frizz therapy flat iron, but as long as your flat iron gets to 410, you can pretty much use any flat iron you want. I am going to kind of bump my ends. I'm not gonna leave it straight. So let's get started. Like I say, I spray my hair glosser, hair polisher. You can use any kind of polish you like. Spray it all over, and then I'm gonna take my thermal spray. This is the Indigo Upscale Veil um, Thermal Spray. You can use Nexus, uh, who else has a good one? Um, anything that says thermal, because what that does, like I said, it gives an extra um, layer for the humidity outside to keep your hair nice and straight as long as you want for your flat iron. And basically, that's about it. We are gonna go ahead, take it through, and like I said, I'm going for a curl so I'm not doing straight. I'm just doing a slight bump on the end. See how it gives you that shine? So the shine is threefold. It is the, the uh, silk press oil, and it is the spray, and the thermal spray actually gives you a little shine too. We'll go ahead and do our second curl. Make sure you get all the way to that root so that it's covered. And like I said, I'm doing just a little bump on my end, and that's it. Go over to the other side. Do this last curl, did I put the curl in there? Yeah, I did. All right, so you see, give you that nice um, shine that you need. Let's go over this one again. Kind of jack this one up. All right, I'm gonna go ahead, part my other section. I'm going to come back when my whole head is done, but if you have those four ingredients that you need, plus the flat iron, you good to go. So I'll be right back after I curl my whole head. All right guys, so I have put my little makeup on, I'm all together, I just gotta put my lipstick on, but this is me all silk pressed out, and usually what I do is just finger through it for some very loose beach wave curls. And that is my final look. Big, poofy, beautiful silk pressed hair. This is the back. And then I usually just spray it with a little, um, a little sheen. I'm gonna go through it a little bit more so I won't look crazy, y'all. And that's about it. Take this this way. Bring it a little forward. There we go. There we go. All right, so if you like this video and you like the products that I use, go ahead, give me a big thumbs up. Uh, go ahead and subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching. Hit that notification bell if you want to be alerted to when I do post another video. Love you guys. Bye.